What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to another episode. And yesterday, if you were joining us, we were building our winter environment, building last year's uh, Christmas set. But some things happened over the last couple of hours that I really wanted to, to dive in and give you a full debrief. And mainly what I am referring to is this. The Lego Ideas, the Orient Train, the Orient Express Train. This was just announced. It is releasing December 1st of this year, which means on December 1st, we can get this and the new modular. So that's kind of going to be wild, going to be crazy. Um, this is, comes with 2,540 pieces. It is set 213488. It includes eight minifigures. And that's a really cool thing because the eight minifigures that are included are the conductor, the train driver, the waiter, railway station manager, a scientist, a duchess, a writer, and a film director. And that is referencing, referencing the creative lego fan who originally submitted this set to lego ideas and a couple things we're going to look at is a just the way how beautiful this looks now i've been reading about it uh it is retailing at 299 however it has been said that you will not be able to make this a remote control conducted train like you can on others so that is kind of a downfall however this does seem to be the the wide range of people saying this is what we wanted from that Harry Potter Hogwarts Express but the Orient Express is what we got and it is really cool it is it is this dark blue and black the 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 box art looks absolutely amazing the build looks beautiful this looks like an amazing display piece I, I'm just blown away at how good this thing looks. And on the inside, you can see it's been widened. So you have a inside conducting cars. Uh, actually, I believe it comes with the, the engine, the coal train, and then two uh, kind of carts with what looks to be a bedroom and a sitting area right here, as well as a bar, which looks really nice, and a little restaurant area. And then you can see the conductor as well. But, I mean, this looks really beautiful. I'm trying to see if these are going to be uh, printed pieces or stickers. I would hope with $300 it is uh, they're printed pieces. However, this looks like a beautiful, beautiful display piece. And to give you an, a sense of scalability the size of this with this man building it i mean that looks would be a very beautiful display piece especially right up there i think that would look really cool so i definitely want this thing however uh and i love the the filmmaker director the the the, the big downfall of this is the 300 dollars price tag for just over 2500 pieces there's rumors that uh lego and the orient express uh line did not come to make very good uh deals so that way now lego is uh giving more of a commission to the orient express uh side of things but if we go to google and look up lego ideas orient express we can see um let's see we gotta find not Lego Ideas, yes. Original. We could see the way that it that it was uh, initially the idea of it. Obviously, Lego did an amazing job when you look at the way this came. I just love the coloring. I'm just really hoping that those are not stickers and those are printed pieces. I love the eight minifigures. Pretty hefty price tag, especially on the release date, because like I said, you're looking at $300 for this. You're looking at the, the museum. That's a lot going on. Um, not sure about gift with purchases, but this is just something I wanted to bring to your attention. 
I mean, this is a really, really cool set. Really beautiful. I love the way it looks. Really hoping to get this. Obviously not day one, but hopefully in the very near future. Uh, may wait till January. But, I mean, ultimately, overall, this thing just looks fantastic. Here's some more looks at it. Um, the Sapphire Star looks really, really cool. Really beautiful display piece. Very intricate detail. Cool building techniques. Like right here you have what looks to be like a, a whiskey decanter. Super cool like that. You have a big bed. Uh, this looks to be like a sticker piece, unfortunately, but interesting to see what that'll be. Uh, I'm not sure if that's like a bunk bed or a shelf. Looks like to be a closet. Um, let's see what else. I mean, that just looks really cool. And I'm sure there's going to be ways of people being able to... I don't know why it's doing this. There we go. I'm sure there'll be ways of people to go in and be able to make this electronically run. But, I mean, look at this art piece. Another decanter. Really cool. You got your lime wedges and your salt. You got your uh, martini glass for your restaurant. Orient Express. Little, I mean, that's really beautiful, detailed. Really exciting about that. Just the way that looks. I mean, that's going to be a really cool display piece. And then if you're able to get it running, too, that would be really cool. And again, this is what a lot of people wished, you know, the Hogwarts train would have been like. But they didn't get that. And, I mean, this thing is just, it's really cool. Really beautiful. Really good design on creating this. Here's another look at basically the opposite side. So you can see it opens up for many different uh, areas, different ways. So that's very cool as well. It seems to be very interactive. You have a nice bathroom here. You can see some toilet paper, a sink, uh, really cool tiled flooring. Haven't seen that design technique yet. And then you can get a look at the mini figures. Again, I love the film director. Very, very cool. Great display piece. So let me know what you all think. Let me know if you think it's it's good, if it's if it's not very, you know, if it's under par. You know, again, this one's got a hefty price tag of $300. So this may be a definite VIP points or a double VIP point purchase weekend. Um, let me know what you think. Are you planning on getting it? Is it something you have on your wish list? Is it surpass expectations of what the original Lego ideas or an express looked like, you know, let me know what your thoughts are. I would love to hear them. I plan on buying it just not immediately, hopefully maybe January, February. I don't know. We'll see, but I mean, I just, I'm really excited for it. I think that blue and black and that gold, I think it looks very nice. So let me know what you think as always. Thank you for joining us. I'm going to hop off right now, though, because today is my wife's birthday. So if you've made it this far, you have to give my wife a shout out. Tell her happy birthday. We're going to go out to a fancy dinner because we don't go out to eat that much. Because when you have three kids, you don't get to. So we're going to go enjoy it. Just wanted to say thank you all for stopping by. I hope you have a great day. Uh, go blue and come back tomorrow. We will see you tomorrow and hopefully finish some more of the Lego building of the Christmas uh, environment. So definitely make sure you come back to see that. So until then, can't wait to see you. Drop a sub, turn on them notifications. Thank you for watching. And as always, stay creative and we will see you next time.